How about uh, growing up with a famous brother? That could be difficult, just especially as my brothers. If uh, your brother, <laughs> oh, I'm kidding. If your brother happens to be Tony Eason, he was a star quarterback for the Patriots in the 80s. Bo Eason, it seems, has always been at his brother's shadow. Despite making it to the NFL as a defensive back for the then Houston Oilers, now he's on a different stage. And as Laura Oakman tells us, Bo's finding acting can be a lot like real life. Don't worry about him. He's my brother. I will color the field red with his blood and drown him in it. They say life is stranger than fiction. Unless you're a member of the Eason family, then for you, life is fiction. Do you see your brother over there? He's sleeping. That's because he can afford to sleep. He's gifted. He is former NFL quarterback Tony Eason, a first-round draft pick of New England in the 80s who helped lead the Patriots to Super Bowl XX. I hated watching, like, my brother play. It was the worst. Like, I'd be with my parents, and this is their little baby down there. And he is his little brother, Bo Eason, a former Oilers safety, and now the writer, producer, and star of a one-man play entitled Runt of the Litter. He's always bigger than me. He was always better. See, that doesn't make any sense to me. See, I'm the one awake every morning at 5 a.m. The play is about a safety for the Houston Oilers getting ready to play in the AFC Championship game against a team which is quarterbacked by his brother, the golden child of the NFL and his own family. I will lead my 45 brave men into a desperate battle against a great field general, my brother, and his 45 brave men. The biggest game of their lives, and basically they'd have to destroy each other to win. Come on, God. You come on. You gave him everything else. You let my 45 be the braver. So while most of us try to hide our childhood baggage, Ethan's is on display night after night in front of thousands of strangers. My perspective of this play, most of it is true. But my brother's perspective or my parents' perspective is, is completely different. My brother and I never played against each other, so I had to make that up. And I never got to live that out. So it, it is kind of fulfilling a fantasy, too, because I get to write what actually happens. So what happened when Tony saw Bo's play for the first time? It was Big Brother who once again stole the show. A girl in the front row passes out and hits the stage head first like this. Boom! My brother jumps over the six chairs, yeah. goes, you call 911. You give me your jacket. You get, and he starts administering, like, taking care of this girl. I'm standing on stage going, this is just like my, my life. <laughs> he stole your <laughs> It was kind of funny. <laughs> But it's Little Brother who is the leading man these days. The run to the litter is about to go national, and even Hollywood is interested. As for the Hollywood ending... Just as my brother was about to step out of bounds, I hit another gear, and there's my brother looking right back at me. Would you have hit him? That, <laughs> that, I mean, that is the question. That I don't know. Well, it looks like uh, an excellent play. You saw that. Yeah, play, I did. What did you think? You know what? It's actually, it was awesome. Hey, guys, I got ADD. I can't sit through a lot of plays. <laughs> this was an awesome, awesome play. He actually said he tried out different endings on different audiences. I'm glad, that, I'm glad you sit through this show, Jay. That's important. <laughs> All right. Hey, you have a brother. You have a brother. I have two brothers. And we kid our brothers because we care. All right.